Hello everyone, my name is Sheffrey and welcome to TCG Card Shop Simulator. I've done some shorts on this so far and I've played a little bit offline, but it's time for me to do a playthrough here on YouTube. So we're going to start this series off. I'm not going to waste too much of your time. Let's just jump right into it. Let's go ahead and name our store. We're walking up to the... Yeah, quit my day job to open my own card game store. This is it. It's time to get down to business. Let's go ahead and name this Sheffrey's Collectibles. Perfect. All right, day one. Day one of Sheffrey's new card store. Come on in, bud. We're open. I can't open shop yet. Oh, it's probably because we have no product. So let's go ahead and open up our phone here. All right, sorry, there we go. We got the card. We got the phone open. We're going up in a stock order. Let's get ourselves our first round of packs. Let's go ahead, get, go ahead and order four boxes. Are we going to sell all of them? Probably not. I'll sell, I think, three and maybe open one for myself. All right, we got these shelves loaded up. Let's go ahead and set a price. Let's market price right now. Two ninety four. All right, let's set these to three dollars for now. Make just a little bit of profit, but hopefully we'll get these flying off the shelves to at least get some sales. So now we can be open. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go I'm gonna put these on sale. Opening day sale, baby. Put them on a discount. First day being open. All right, now we just need someone to come on in and buy some stuff. Hello, sir. Come on in. Welcome to Sheffrey's Collectibles. You're our first customer. So cheap. You bet your sweet bippy it's cheap. I hope it's tempting. And grab all the packs you want. There we go. Big sale to start us off with. What do we got? 11 whole packs. Nice. Type this out on my number pad, because that's just the best way to go. <gasps> we got a stinker. Oh no. I don't have any uh, spray yet. I can't get it until we're level 2. I just have to deal with a stinky man in my shop. How dare you. Come into my shop stinking up the place. I mean, it will take your $30. I do appreciate it. Nice. Packs are flying off the shelf already. Todd came in here just for 11 packs. I appreciate it. I think the checkout noises might be a little bit loud, so I think I'm going to turn them down just a little bit. There we go. Hopefully that's a little bit better. All right, so I need to successfully complete five checkouts. Well, here we got one more coming in right now. Welcome to Sheffrey's Collectibles. What can I do for you today? We have basic card packs, and that's, well, that's about it. So I hope you like them. And everyone is stocking up on the basic card packs. There must be some hits in here. The man here's got 14. Oh, we're level two. Okay, good. Let's get the uh, let's get that stink spray. Let's go ahead and throw that into the cart. We'll also decide. Let's sell some sleeves. Let's grab two things of sleeves. They're usually a good thing just to fill your your shelves with early on. Upgrade our card pack license to the one slightly bigger. Add another box of that in. Send that off. Oh, hello. Welcome to Sheffrey's Collectibles. I will take your, your money today. Thank you. All right, it's today and today only, because tomorrow they're going up in price. Get them while they're hot. All right, so we got, uh, we got some sleeves that can go up here for sale now. So load those up on here. Be a full box of 40. Get that thrown out. Set these to two dollars. Any for you today, sir. Just four packs? That's all you're gonna do? Alright. Well, have a nice day. And don't ever come to my store again. Just kidding. Come back and buy more packs. Please. Please and thank you. Okay, so I'm just gonna set this uh anti spring yep. <laughs> Anti stink spray off to the side for now. We'll get these guys all checked up. Checked out, I mean. Get them on their way. Save this extra pack of sleeves. Set that off onto the side. That'll be our product we have on hand. Another $20. Thank you, sir. 
Thank you for visiting Sheffrey's Collectibles. Now the real fun begins. Let's stock a little bit back onto the shelves just so we make sure we got a uh, decent product for sale. And then let's crack open specs. Ooh, a $9 one. I'll take that right off the rip. First pack. First pack's a good one. Everything is going to be new for now. Actually, here, let me put, let me go ahead and put these back down. Just so I can get these people all checked out. We got a stinker, but he's spending a lot of money. So you know what? I'm going to let it go this time. But don't ever come back to my store smell like this again. Well, too much change. Hang on. I'm t I can totally count. Don't worry. There we go. We got some big spenders at, Sheff at Sheffrey's Collectibles opening day sale. All right, crack it open a couple more packs. Let's go. What do we got? All right, two dollars. Lost money on that pack. That's okay. Watch me pull like a thousand dollar card in my first packs. All right, so that's fine for now. Let's go ahead and uh, let's just sell these for now until I can afford. I mean, the singles are fine to like collect for now, but it's until we can buy the singles table that we can actually start selling them. So first of all, I'm gonna do what it tells me to do. We gotta go to my DIY. We gotta buy a play table. We get some people coming in here. Get to entice the entice people to come in. We'll put them right in the window even. Show them off to the world. All right, let's get these people checked out. Thank you for coming to Sheffrey's Collectibles. Hope you found everything okay. And if not, well, sucks to suck, I guess. There's only one shelf. And I feel that guy right there. I'll buy his lonesome. No one's going to come in and play with you. I mean, if only I could sit down and play with you. It is just the regular event, right? Yeah, I figured. Just day one. Day one, do we have any bills to pay? Nope, we're all good today. Look at that. I should probably turn the lights on, though. Okay, so we can go ahead and throw some more. People have been clear us in it, clearing us out of those sleeves. I think that's why it's a good thing to have them on hand is because, I mean, one, they fill the shelf super easy. That's a pretty decent little bit of profit I can make off them. Until this guy comes in and just buys two. All right, there you go. You might have a, there you go. You got a play buddy finally. So I, th I think, because I've played before, but uh, the game's been getting updated pretty consistently, which is also really good to see. I'm glad to see the uh, developers care a lot about the game. Um, 14.50, there you go, you're on your way out. Look at you, sharply dressed man, taking a big spender here. What do we got for you today? We got 22 basic card packs and five packs of sleeves. Somebody's doing some, par uh, some card opening tonight. Are you gonna be live on Twitch or? $35 back. Thank you for your $65. I appreciate it. Somebody's going to watch the game before he goes. Um, yeah, so what I said is uh, the, the, I believe the game is updated to now where they'll actually use play mats instead of just having the cards on the table like this, but I think it it's dependent on you actually having the play mats for sale. So hopefully we'll have those soon and uh, We'll be able to see those in action. I think they also have like the deck boxes, like other accessories they can buy. I think they have started having them out on the tables now, which I think is like a really cool thing to do. Um, but yeah, so let's, uh, you know, this is fair. You bet your sweet bippy it is. Bring that on over here. Bring that sweet, juicy $20 on over to Sheffrey. Thank you for shopping at Sheffrey's Collectibles. Please enjoy your view of the game on the way out. We only have one table. Just kidding. Now we have two. It says, let 10 customers play in the shop. So let's speed this along a little. <gasps> we got a stinker. Get him. All right. Get him, get him with the anti-sting spray for now. Put that back on in there. Appreciate you at least spending, what do we got? Almost $20. Your 50 cents back. You get up on out of here. Bring us to a close in the end of day one. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. All right, we're coming up on the end of day one here. I bought a third table just to move things along a bit, and now I can keep a close eye on these people. 
that's Keelan in my store, my one shelf full of my product. And I restocked it with some, uh, just some basic card packs. We got the sleeves up top. And that's pretty much going to be it until tomorrow, I think. So let's skip ahead into uh, day two. All right, day two. Let's get this party started, shall we? So what are we looking at? Buy a card table and put in a stinker? Not in my shop. How dare you come into Sheffrey's Collectibles, smelling up the place. You're like me in the hurricane, haven't showered in days. I forgot to change the price on these packs. Whoops. Change needs four dollars and sixty cents. I don't know why that was so hard to count out, but I got it. All right, let's change these pack. Let's change this number here. Hey, why did these drop down so much? I may have something going. On. We have a bug going on here. Um, okay, so we're gonna set this to market price ten percent. We'll charge three dollars for these packs now, and I don't want to charge fifty cents for these packs. Hopefully, no one got a bug. Hopefully no one got those for a steal. There we go, got that price back up now. Another stinker, how dare you come into my store, how dare you, I will write a sternly worded letter to your mother. Alright, get that back in there, get this box just settled down. Get Mr. Big Spender over here, I'm gonna crack some packs, maybe grade some cards. I actually think that's coming to the game eventually, like a card grading type thing. Nine dollars from Kevin here. Thank you for shopping here, sir. Uh, I have to unfortunately buy another card table. <laughs> Unless it means... Oh, I meant single table, didn't it? <sighs> well... Come on down to Sheffrey's Collectibles where you can play cards if you want. That's about all you can do here. Hey, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna make the I'm gonna put the shelf like literally right as you walk in. And then I can just put the tables back here. And that way people coming in a shop will just grab the stuff, come right up to the counter, and then anyone who's wanting to play can just come in and play. It'll be like the tiniest tiniest store ever. You can forget the rest of this place exists because, well, it doesn't anymore. Holy smokes. We just sold a whole booster box. 27 packs for $81. Thank you very much, ma'am. I appreciate it. I think you also just like cleared me out of my stock too, so. Let's order a couple boxes of that. And I think even some sleeves are in order. And, oh, I can get the boxes. Uh, I'm going to save up for a singles table, though, before we get the collection boxes. Oh, the collection boxes are good. Oh, I can't afford everything. Oh. Uh, okay, what if I just sell what about two of those? There we go. Okay. I need the packs, man. That's what the people are here for. I think this kind of works better though because like instead of just having the boxes because this way I'm like getting a lot more experience per like I think because you get experience per item sold so like the more I can kind of maximize those in the beginning I think I and mean, if I'm wrong you guys can feel free to let me know in the comments below if you have any tips or tricks or anything I can do to make this a little bit easier or if you just want to see some more TCG card shop simulator from me let me know in the comments down below I've been really enjoying this game it's been kind of my new addiction for for a little bit now um, I mean, I do want to get back into like Diablo 4 and, you know, continuous satisfactory. And then I don't know if you guys saw, but next year Subnautica 2 comes out. Pretty excited for that. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's, uh, let's keep on going here. But I need to buy a card table. So that means I need to make some good money. I actually may, uh, box one of these up because I made a mistake. I'm going to sell it. Give me an extra hundred bucks. Yes, I lose a hundred bucks, but that's okay. There we go. Just need people in here and playing with the cards. 
I'm not playing with the cards. Buy, in, buy in some cards. Buy my cards, please. Yeah, that's what we're, we're looking for. Uh, card table. Right here, 400 bucks. Pays itself off really quickly. Just need to actually get that $400 in sales first. So I might just speed it along until we get there, unless anything crazy happens. Can't find basic card box. I'm working on it, okay? Come into my store, my one shelf store, and ask for something I don't have. How dare you. All right, it only took a few hours. In-game, not, not IRL. But uh, we finally got the old card table. We're going to slap this down right next to our one shelf here. And keep this a nice compact store to start us off with. Um, and now we can actually finally start listing our, our singles. So let's go ahead and grab. I'm not going to worry about uh, holding on to duplicates or anything for now. We'll, uh, we'll start getting into that a little bit later once we actually have the cards. Well, I like to mark everything up a good 20-30% above market value, so about a dollar at least a card. There we go. That's all some singles. Get this stinker out of my shop. You come in here smelling like that. Ain't no way. Alright, day three. We're level five at least, so when we have the money, we can unlock these rare card packs and start opening those. We're gonna need at least 300 before we can get there. Um, I think everything else is, we're still waiting on. Oh, we do have dice now that we can sell, uh, but I'm gonna wait on that license as well. Those are 50 each, and I know they're like over $200 to buy like a, a set of dice, so I'll wait on those ones for sure. So, oh, we got a lineup already. Hello, welcome to Chevrolet's Collectibles. Hope you found everything okay. If not, then I'll get the f out of my store. A little day three action. Starting it off nice, getting a little bit of sales. We're up to $100 now. Excellent. I really need these singles to move, so you know what I might do? I might just round them off at market price. And see if we can get it moving because we gotta sell 10 singles. Usually they just fly off the shelf, but for some reason they're not moving just yet. All right, well, it's been, it's almost 10 a.m. and we only have two guys playing cards, so let's go ahead and open some packs. Everything's just gonna be new because we haven't opened enough things yet. Ooh, $3. Already got a customer. All right, well, let's go and put those back. Let me check you out first. Customer comes first, right? Better appreciate it. Back to back green hoodies. You guys best friends. Two singles. Thank you, sir. You know what? Have 50 extra cents. Because I love you. Alright, back to card opening. I need something valuable. Come on. Okay, well that was a five dollar pack. I can take that. Another five bucks, let's go. Here we go. Oh, now we're in the, the, I was gonna say, now we're in the red, but that would mean I'm losing money. Now we're in the green. All right, ended up with a good handful of like $5 cards there. So now we should be able to make like, I don't know, good like 50 or, 50 or 60 bucks from our singles. As long as they actually start moving. Start boosting them up a little bit, like 10, 20, 30% of our uh, market price. If you saw my uh, short on what's a really good thing to sell, I mean, as far as I'm concerned, the singles sell really well, usually at least, um, especially if you're considering things that go for like the over their market value. Plus, I mean, these are more or less, they're not all profit, but like it's all profit because I already lost the money of opening the pack. So I mean, you might as well sell them anyway, right? So, all right, we're doing okay. So I think instead of waiting for the 300 to get the rare pack, I think I'm actually gonna get the boxes. And then I can order a set of those because I think the profit margin on these is pretty good. And I think you also get pretty decent XP as well. I know you do definitely from the later boxes, but I mean, market price. Let's say we'll charge 25 for these. We'll make 11 bucks a box. That's actually pretty good. God, I really need to get some more people. We're like coming up at the end of day three here and it's the least exciting day so far. Like a couple hundred bucks for level six. 
I did move my anti my deodorant spray onto the shelf to sell it. It is way overpriced, so hopefully people don't buy it, and then I can just come and grab it as I need it, and then we'll just put it back on the shelf. Um, this is just how I usually do it to keep people from you know clearing me out of my stock until I get the sprayers, um, and then I'll just sell it normally. But you know sometimes people do overpay for it. So oh my boxes are almost gone. My singles are doing okay. I still got to get rid of three more singles. That's my a box for another 25 bucks, another $11 in profit. $11 in profit. I don't know what happened to my voice there. Uh, what do you guys want me to stand out here and just like jump around and wave and be like, come on, Jeffrey's collectibles. Things are sort of on sale. Not really. Everything is above market value, but Hey, you'll always get a sort of good deal at Jeffrey's collectibles. All right, it's day five. Please, no, no, day four. Please, please come buy my stuff. We need, we need money. Please, please come to Sheffrey's Collectibles. All right, day four sucks so far. Time to open some packs. Let's get this going. We need some hits. Sheffrey needs some money. There we go. Thirty-six dollar card. Hey, just gotta yell at the game. That's all. That's all. It's a piece of sh. Then you'll be fine. Like, hey, 2CG simulator, card simulator, shop simulator. Yeah, you, uh, your mom made me pancakes this morning. How about that? $4. See, there you go. $4. $15. Hey. See, you talk a little smack to it, and the game's like, oh, okay, I got you. Ah. See, now we're rolling in the money. Rolling in the hits. Another $5, another $1. Might as well just retire now. Oh, we got a whole lineup here at the store. Thank you for waiting here at Sheffrey's Collectibles. Sorry if there was a bit of a wait there. I got a little excited about the cards I was opening. Hope you get some good pulls as well. Holy smokes! Man just bought my whole shelf of boxes. All right, cool. Thank you for your $150 order. Here's your $34 back. We go ahead and throw this uh, single up here, get some money back off this one. Let's throw that 30% over. We can throw it at $49. You know what? I will leave it at 49. I was gonna say, maybe I'll just round it to 50, but. Let's go, you know, now that we've been cleared out of all our boxes, look at those loaded back up. Anything still in here? Five packs left. All right, what do we got? Let's take all five and we'll open them. See, there's still literally no one coming in the shop, so we may as well pass some time with opens and packs. Speed the addiction. Not pretty solid. 10, 15, 16 dollar pack. Take those. Hey, another 45 dollar card. Let's go. What is this? I can't tell. It doesn't have the name on it. Oh no, we got a stinker. You're gonna come into my shop smelling up the place. How dare you, sir? Just deal with you really quick. Thank you. Well, if you didn't come in here stinking, maybe I wouldn't have to spray you. Oops, 12, not 21. I mean, I guess you did spend a whole $19, so I'll let, I'll let it slide for this one. But don't you ever come back smelling like that. Okay, so still a pretty boring day four so far. A couple little hits out of the out of the card packs. I don't think we got anything left in here, so might as well just get rid of this box now. So we got uh, 22 sleeves to throw up on the shelf. Rest quick, do a little quick restock on those. And then please come into Sheffrey's Collectibles. I'll put things on sale. Can we put things on sale? How about this? Twenty-four fifty. Fifty cents off. Just for today. Today only. Oh, I thought he turned around to get one. <laughs> Alright, we're coming up on the end of day four. We got about four hours left. Not too many. Nothing crazy going on. We're still I can get the rare card pack license. 
but we're just gonna be waiting a little bit before we can actually order the packs. I'm thinking we'll probably end up ordering them tomorrow on day five. And then we'll hopefully get just a few more customers rolling in here tonight. Keep me keep these singles well stocked as we go. We will just come and pick them clean as we go. Couple six dollar cards to put out there. A little stinker in the shop, but it looks like he's leaving. Absolutely good riddance. Hawk Tua, get out of my store. You are not welcome at Sheffrey's Collectibles. All right, let's get a rotation. Get these people up out of the store. Buy something or get out. Oh, good. A few of them are buying something. So also, if you guys ever know, if you're at the end of the day at 9 o'clock and you still have people playing in the store, make sure you go along and kick them all off the table because you can usually end up getting a few last-minute sales from them. All right, let's get some of these rare card packs. Let's go and order two of them. Some to open, some to sell. And throw these up on the shelf here. They can take the place of that for now. Get those priced out at five bucks a pack. You ready for this stinker who's probably gonna be coming in the store? I'm ready for you. I'm gonna spray at the ready. I mean, you can technically spray them outside the store too if you wanted to, just be proactive. All right, while we wait for those guys to finish up their game, we're gonna crack open a few packs here. These are all probably gonna be new again. Day five, and I still haven't made profit on any of the days so far. So let's cross our fingers and hope today's some profit. I think the only reason I lost money yesterday was because I had to buy the license for this box. Otherwise, I would have actually made some money. Today is the day, though. I can feel it. Rare card pack's a little expensive. Buddy, it's like a dollar over market price. What are you complaining about? You can get a basic card pack for two cents less. He complains about it, and he just bought a fat stack of them, didn't he? He oh my god. <laughs> Oh, this stuff's a little expensive. I guess I'll buy 13,000 of them. All right, didn't I say today's the day of profit? And here's our friend Steven just packing us up, taking all we got, all our collector boxes, literally two cans of overpriced cleanser. What a just scholar, gentleman and a scholar, Steven. I'm gonna give you a smooch. I'm gonna give you, you know what? I'm gonna give you some change anyway. You don't need any change, but I'm giving you a dollar back just because I love you. That's what I'm saying. Today's the day Jeffrey's Collectibles finally makes some money. Hopefully. I did have to restock those boxes. Now I'm going to have to restock them again. <laughs> Maybe I should buy, uh, might buy two. I bet I can buy two and still make profit. More overpriced cleanser going out the door today. How about that? Maybe it's not so overpriced. I've, actually, you know what? Maybe I should probably check that. <laughs> okay, yeah, so it's still overpriced. They're just like, you know what? I really need it. That's right. Six dollars and change. You get six singles. Head on over to the strip club. Enjoy. Take your take your Pokemon cards. <laughs> Open them up at the strip club. Okay, so let me order two of these boxes. And honestly, I should still make profit. It's only noon, so we should still be okay. Bring the other one in. Just kind of tucked away in the corner for now. You doing some shopping? Are you doing some playing? Wait, is that all my cleaner almost gone? Jeez. I like how I overpriced my cleaner by like 50%. And it's like, you know what? We will take it. What a, what a deal. All right, I know I wanted to make profit today, but, well, first, let's pay our bills. Make sure we do that. Second of all, it's time, a new shelf. I'm just gonna get a little one though, because I think these ones are really good for uh, putting sleeves and stuff on. We'll just start with this. Grab all our sleeves off the top here, put them back in the box. Load them up onto the shelf here. That's going to be our little accessory shelf for now. The 
And that way this can be for all like just our cards and stuff, our card packs and stuff. Thank you for buying this one card from us today. I'll give you give you a little 50 cents bonus. I didn't want to count out. I'll give you $40, I'll take it. Be always good to have sleeves on hand. Sell pretty well. Taking my overpriced cleanser, I appreciate you. One singular card for a whole four dollars. Make sure you take this all in ones too. Gonna run out of ones. I don't think you can actually run out of like bills in this game. That would be funny though. It's like just try and give someone change all in pennies and be like, man, I ran out of pennies. So four dollars on that. Just a little twenty percent markup on everybody. Beautiful. All right, that's it. That's the end of day five. All the people on the play tables are leaving. No one wanted to buy anything on the way out. That's just rude. We're ending off with some semi-full shelves. They did some restocking throughout the day, so I'm still just crossing my fingers. We're going to be in the green for today. Show me some profit. Come on, profit for Sheffrey's collectibles. Can we do it? Only three to satisfy. Not too bad. We paid our bills. We restocked. We made a profit of almost $300. Wow, that's actually pretty good. So that'll actually allow me to probably buy some more licenses as well as uh, maybe even some expansion. Not even, or not expansion, but like more shelves. Um, so I think I'll actually bring the episode for today to a close. But uh, if you guys enjoyed the TCG Trading Card Shop Simulator, if you guys like Sheffrey's Collectibles, make sure you let me know down below. Leave a like and comment. If you're not subscribed already, please do. Let me know to make make more of these videos. And uh, yeah, other than that, that's the nice little first six days. We're level seven, about to be level eight. We got the rare card packs. We should be able to get a few new things as well. Um, looks like we've unlocked. We got dice. We got ooh, we got red deck boxes. We got deck boxes now. We got plushies. Plushies are going to be one I really like to sell as well. And the playmats. We got plushies, playmats, deck boxes, dice, lots more accessories, really. Um, but not too much more like packs and stuff yet. So um, make sure you come back for another episode of Sheffrey's Collectibles, and I'll see you guys in the next one.